Hello guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. In today's video, we will see how to fix Samsung Galaxy Watch 7 not register on network. So without wasting your time, let's get started. So the step one is to verify your watch model. So let's ensure that your Galaxy Watch 7 is a LTE model. So only LTE models can connect to a mobile network independently. Because the Galaxy Watch 7s are comes with two models. First one is a LTE model and second one is a only Bluetooth model which cannot support LTE. Okay, means eSIM. So the step two is check mobile plan activation. So make sure your mobile plan is activated and compatible with your watch. Okay, to check you can simple open the variable app. So in variable app you can simple click on watch watch settings. Okay, so in watch settings you can simple scroll down and then click on mobile plans so in mobile plans you will here see your service provider name and a activation button is turns on okay so you can confirm that the plan is active and that your watch has its own phone number okay you can easily call and also when you swipe down to open quick panel here you will see a uh, your service provider name and a uh, LTE okay step 3 Restart your device or simple restart can resolve many compatibility issue. Okay, so to restart you can simple press and hold the power button and the bottom button together until you see a Samsung logo on the screen. So once you see a Samsung logo, you can simply leave it as it is. It will take two to three minutes to restart your watch. Okay, step four, update software. So ensure your watch is running at the latest software version. Okay. So to update the software you can simply open settings go to software update scroll down and then click on download and install and here you will find a new software is available if available you can simply download them okay so if a uh, software update is not resolved your issue so it may be another issue so in this case you can simply contact the co samsung customer support for further assistance they can also check for any account related issues that might be causing this problem. Okay, so if you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more tech tips and tutorial. Goodbye.